I was inking a maths copy in my grandmother's house with the police knocking. 06 DG pogging the concrete, where my little sister keeps chalking neat boxes, one, two, three, concealed on it for her feet topping. Just a young trick teen gawking. The sleepless peeps on the streets eavesdropping peaked on it. Nails between teeth gnawing away the feeling of reaching any means of precaution. I lean forward in the seat watching. They proceed in routine. A six foot three marine posture that speaks to his colleague in a kind of stretched dialect I could tell he was raised in the field cropping. The mutter of others, thumping of swinging drawers and Pops, what are they looking for? He's dealing with circumstances we can't agree on. He heard the question, but his thoughts are screaming on him, so he ignored it. I heard a thump of a previous jump landed where Grandad planted seeds in autumn. Season's gone, trees blossomed. Back door swung, hands thrown up. Parade of raiders marched so rough, screaming alarming code words to the contraption strapped to his guarded shoulder. They had him. A person who I looked up to is in one of those cars where the sound matches the flashing strobe up. Blue and white. And as I watched them reverse and the car slow turn, I asked again, Pops, what were they looking for? He abruptly interrupted me. He said, little man, you'd never understand. They're looking for boxes with white in them. And I tried to handle my unfinished match homework. Imagine the innocence.